Hey guys, I'm back. I'm still wearing the same shirt. This is the second video to my other video that I made, the mini Macy's haul. So in this video, I'm actually going to be using the products, right? So in the last video, I kind of just like reviewed the products and like, you know, felt the brushes and did some swatches. But in this video, I'm going to actually be using the products. So let's see if these products are good. Um, just wanted to let you remind you guys, all of these products were like, Eight dollars and less like the palettes were eight dollars and less and then the brushes were like thirteen dollars so i'm not really expecting the most out of this stuff but i am going to be using they didn't have concealer they didn't have conceal they didn't have foundation concealer um i did find kind of like this foundation powder stuff that i'm going to use as a finishing powder I guess and then I found in my little box I found some bronzer which they did not have bronzer but they do have there was a palette that had blush so I think I'm gonna use blush from there and I'm gonna use a highlight from there and um I did not get the lip stuff did I but I got I have I'm gonna use this color today because I'm gonna like I want my eyes to be the main center focus here right so this is kind of like a nudie pink color which I just kind of wanted something simple, something that will kind of just like match my actual colored lips. And then obviously if the face brushes and stuff do not work, I do have my beauty blender. So let's hope that I don't have to use it. And then I did find this Mac Max Master Fix finishing powder. So, okay. And then I have my primer. So I'm not sure use eyeshadow primer as face primer but I don't have face primer so we're going to use it as face primer so it's extremely good for the eyes which I absolutely love my makeup literally does not move ever so All right, so my face is all primed. Let me just put a little bit, because this one didn't really get as much. All right, primer is done. So what we're going to be doing, I can't remember if you're supposed to put, I think it's foundation first. So I'm going to be using my Dior, Dior um forever natural nude and i am the shade 2n um this is a tent 24 hour perfection blah blah blah, blah. you get one fluid ounce with this so oh okay so it just pops off you guys. So I'm just gonna put a little bit. Three, I mean, three is, three is a lot, but, cause this is kind of like a powder brush, large face brush. So I'm gonna just use this, no, detailing brush. I'm gonna use this brush. And hopefully, okay, so I do not edit my videos and I do apologize, you guys. And I'm using this, this, uh, okay, so my foundation is on, it looks it looks nice. I will say that around the nose area, um, I don't think this is a foundation issue. I'm pretty sure it's a eyeshadow primer issue because, you know, you should probably use a face primer with your face and not an eyeshadow primer. I'm just going to work. 
And then if you can see, it's kind of like getting clumpy around my eyes. I don't know if you can see. Can I zoom in? I cannot zoom in. But it's getting a little clumpy around the eyes. Like, you know when you first wake up and you got like the, the eye crusties? Like it's kind of like around there. Next, we're going to go in with our highlighter. We are using the Hourglass in Cedar Vanish. Um, you get two fluid ounces. Perfect. So, that's what it looks like. Using, like, a very bright concealer um, because I do kind of want to just go natural, like, warm right so we're gonna go back in with the same brush and we're just gonna blend I will say that I'm constantly um, getting that crease like right here like not even like under my lip it's like down more right need to work on that so, I'm just going to blend this out. I, I look caked on. So. Next. So, next we're going to go in with this powder. We are going to be using the big large face brush. And we're just going to dip, 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 dip. It has like some screens stuff in there. So we're just gonna dip, 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 dip. Get the brush nice and coated. I need to get a mirror, like legit. Like this is, this is ridiculous. I mean, I, I am using this palette, but still. Um, and we're just gonna go in and me or does my face look dirty like a different I don't know so the next thing we're gonna do is I can't believe I'm doing my full face before I do my eyes anyways so we need to add some color to my face. So we are gonna use this bronzer. I know I said I was going to toss it, but <laughs> the small face brush. So we're just gonna dive right in, get the product, and then like liquid bronzer and then they'll put like a powder bronzer on top and just make it pop more so I might just do that I don't know if it's just me or if this is just not blending And then Avi put some underneath. You gotta hide that double chin. Okay. <sighs> Anyways, next I'm gonna put on, I'm gonna try the blush. So in this palette, we have the blush and the highlight. I'm gonna use this for some blush. Oof. I need to get myself a mirror. Mm -hmm. 
got it. Bam. I I need to do with this side. That's so I'm just gonna go in and I'm gonna go in with my powder. And I'm just gonna kind of try and take this down a little bit, you know, just Is that better? It's a lot better. Like, it's not as, you know. So, next is the highlight, my favorite part. So, we are going to go in with the highlighter brush. And we are going to be using beaming. I will say, it seems that these colors are better applied with a brush than your finger. So I'm just going to dip in, get some product on the brush. I feel like I'm like using too much. So then we're going to kind of Okay. I mean, it's there. Do the other side. It's definitely there. Let's go down the nose. The highlight is definitely there. It's definitely pointing out my acne. Um, but I just kind of want it to be a little bit like more, you know, just. definitely there definitely there pinks the cheeks are definitely pinking all right and then i'm gonna take this this small highlight bro. no because i want to put the highlight on my okay anyways so the face let me The face is done. So I'm going to be using this palette, right? But I'm going to be using this mirror. <laughs> so. so my eyes are already primed from before. So I'm going to go ahead and take this eyeshadow brush. And, or should I take, I think I'm going to take, no, this is a blending brush. So I'm going to take this one and I'm going to go in with this color. So none of these have names. So I'm gonna go in with this color right here as my base. I'm just gonna pack this on the brush and put it all over my eyelid. So I have very, um, what do you call it? Like where my lid like basically disappears underneath the skin on top. So I, whenever I do eyeshadow, I always have to bring it up like almost to my eyebrow so you can actually see, you know, the design, I guess you can say. So now I'm gonna use this blending brush and I'm gonna go I kind of want to do blue 
I'm gonna go in with this kind of light brown color. It's called Rosewood. I'm gonna go in with this color. And we'll actually be able to see if these palettes mix well, I guess. If the product formulas mix well with each other. So I'm gonna put it like literally all over my lip, like in the crease area. I'm gonna put it all over, just blend that out in the crease, kind of come down a little bit onto the lid, but just really just pack it in there. The crease, bring it to the crease, bring it below the crease. All right, so that's gonna be kind of like, you know, and then we're gonna go in with this palette, the blue palette, the Bella Perry palette, and we're gonna go in. I really wish this palette didn't have such a sheen to it, but we're going in with this palette, this color. So we're gonna do this color, and then we're gonna do like this medium, or should I just? All right, so I think I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go in this, this color right here. This one, or should I do this one? This one and this one? I don't know, I'm gonna do these two and then I'll figure, I'll figure the rest out. So, I'm just like, I don't know what I'm doing, you guys. I'm just, I don't know. So, so with the same blending brush, I'm gonna use, no, I think I'm gonna use the lighter blue. Again, these do not have names, so I do apologize. So I'm gonna take that lighter blue and I'm gonna put it, mm, these, maybe I should take this little much lighter, lighter blue. Let me tap it in, there we go. So far, no fallout. So that's good. So far. Take some more of that blue. So I actually went in with this blue. Right here. I went in with that blue. So that's going to be kind of like my main blue color. And then the other one, the darker one, is going to be more of like my corner, my corner color. So this is gonna go all over. Let's bring it up a little bit, you know, bring it to the eyebrow just a little bit. So when I close my, you know, you can still see it. It's looking fabulous. Um, just a little bit more. And then we're gonna switch eyes. Are gonna need a couple of coats. These aren't that pigmented. So obviously you're gonna need to go in a couple times. And then I'm gonna go in with a darker blue. Sorry, I don't really want like the palette like in your guys' face. So I think I'm gonna go in with this blue right here. Or should I do this blue? I'm gonna go in this blue. And we're just gonna we're just gonna see what this what this does, you know. We're gonna come in. And just oh yeah. And I'm gonna keep this blue, like literally. Ooh. That's a lot of Please do not. Don't swipe. Please don't swipe. Because if you swipe, I'm going to have to restart this whole entire thing. Do not. I'm going to just go lightly. Just very. Oh, it's wiped. It swiped a little bit. Let me bring you guys closer. You see it? Do you see it? It 
it's okay. it's okay. I'll just not get as much product as one time. I guess you could. I'm just gonna pat it in the corner. Just keep it in the corner. You can come out a little about halfway and then just go back. Good. And you bring it down to your eyeshadow, eyelash. So if I only get a little bit of the time and then Oh my god. You guys see this fallout? Like it's not like oh it's not focusing. with this uh, oh, eyeshadow blending brush anyways I'm actually gonna use this to pack on so I think I want to go back in with oh my god this eyeshadow is like literally everywhere concealer I'm gonna put it on my eyes because I'm gonna put this color in my crease so give me a second I'm gonna go in with this color right here because if you saw my other video and you saw that swatch, a oh girl. So Major fallout. Also, the shine, the glitter does not stay. Does not stay as soon as you try to blend it out or you blink or whatever, it just kind of falls off. So, yay. So, this has major fallout. Like, major uh, major fallout so i mean i will say the br the brushes are n very nice i really really like the brushes i love these brushes um next is my mascara that i absolutely love like i've been using it like every day since i've gotten it and it's it's amazing like it literally it's by tarte to be mascara um if you saw my Ulta haul, like I got this a couple days ago and I absolutely love it. Like I've been using it all the time, every day. Like even if I'm not wearing makeup, I do my lashes like because it's amazing. Like look. 
at that compared to like my natural you can't even see my natural but that is amazing oh there is something going on with my lighting and I don't understand this I don't know but if you just look at that you saw that right <laughs> camera work So I'm absolutely in love with this mascara, you guys. Like it's so, like it just makes my lashes look freaking. Okay. So now it's the last part. Y'all are probably like, thank God. Like this video has been so freaking long. And it is the lips. I do not know how to line my lips. So I'm not even going to try to line my lips. I'm going to have to watch and how to. Mm -hmm, and how to do that. Okay. So I'm just. I'm using um, Live Glam. First class. It's like a pinkish nude. It's, it's very cute. Let's go. Okay, so I don't know. I don't know what's going on, you guys. Like, my makeup is. I don't know. Like, look at those eyelashes. Do you see it? I don't, I can't see it, but I can see this one. Oh, you can, you can see it just a little. But this is today's look. I don't know what the fuck is going on, but I do wanna thank you guys. I will, okay, so review, review. So I use this palette mostly. Um, I will say, most of these colors are very beautiful. This fallout, so much fallout. All of like, this had so much fallout. This I used, this color had so much fallout. Like literally like under my eyes right here are blue. I forgot to put mascara on the bottom. Lashes. What is coming on? What is going on? Okay, so I now, I shut out my bottom lashes, and I will say I've realized that my corner lashes touch. So, like, the tops and the bottom lashes, like, in the corners, they, like, touch. So then when I put mascara on them, yeah, it just feels weird. Anyways. So, review. For today, I am very happy, very excited to say I really, really liked, loved, loved the brushes. I think these were amazing. Loved them. Next is this palette. Oh, let me put more... <clears throat> this palette I use three colors from this palette two of these palettes two of these colors major fallout I don't think you can see but especially this one blue just a blue 
um I do want to try and give it another go because this color was very nice it didn't really have fallout at all so I really like this color I do want to try the other colors I don't know if it's just the shimmy colors that are fallout or like you know these matte colors on the bottom if they're really good so I am going to try and give this this palette another go I do have two other palettes that I do really want to try I have this palette I want to try and then I did use one color I did use one color from this palette, which was uh, this color, which was really pretty. It was a very pretty color. Very, I mean, it was very light. It wasn't really pigmented, but it was it was cute. I did the I did use this highlighter. It's it's there. It's not blinding, but it's there, and it's cute. You know, like it's definitely like you can definitely tell I'm wearing eyeliner. Your um highlighter blush i used this blossom color oh my god extremely pigmented had to like kind of like dull it down a little bit and blush definitely pigmented definitely there i'm kind of excited to see the other blush because you know there are two blushes in here so i think the next time i will try and use the other two right so i used this one and i used this one in today's video so i'm gonna try and use these two give them a fair shot you know um so i'm kind of excited to use this palette and use this palette i will be doing i will be going to macy's again in schaumburg and see what kind of products they have there i do want to get actually get a face primer because i don't think you should be using eye primer for your face and my all-time love this mascara is amazing love it always will always love it no matter what did you see the lashes you want me to show you again um <laughs> so absolutely loved it loved it loved it loved it i loved these brushes they are so soft they you know they just glide on the skin and they pick up a ton of product so you're not having to like dig in there to get product on your brush picks up a lot of product and it just it doesn't soak up the the product like i can still put foundation like there's literally still foundation on this brush and i can just coat my entire hand with it like that's how i mean like it doesn't soak up the product which i really like um so these brushes are definitely a pass for me not a pass a yes for me i definitely love these brushes i love them so much this these two colors a pass i don't think i'll ever use these colors again like if you look at the blue like the the hard shimmers are not even there like it kind of just formed transformed into like a A shimmer i guess you can say Ew. um but i will brushes definitely love um how are you feeling yes no i got some small ass lips but anyways that is it for today's video i do want to thank all of you guys for watching and i just let me know what you guys want to see in next week's video. I will see you guys all next week. Thank you. Have an amazing day and night wherever you are. And I will see you again. Bye.